A chilly southeast Texas wind whips American flags at the livestock show and rodeo. As a wheelchair-bound Vietnam vet works to give military personnel returning from Iraq and Afghanistan a warm welcome home. Some of us in the past didn't get a welcome home. The troops now, they're getting taken care of, and I want it to stay that way. With his service dog at his side, Bill Callahan says he volunteers for the rodeo and other charitable events. During this year's rodeo, the former POW was so impressed with the vendor's rock sculptures honoring America that he tried to raise money to buy this one for a future display at Reliant Park. Instead, the vendor, Utah-based The Rock Place, is giving the sculpted tribute to Callahan. We love it. And it gives us a, it's given us blessings where we've been able to do great things for people like Bill in our travels. The Rock Place says the donated monument could have sold for $8,000. The artist behind it says the company is donating it because it loves the military. The, the military that make it possible for all of us to enjoy the, the special freedoms that we have in this very, very unique country. The folks who run the Rock Place say they are so impressed with Texas and the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo that they'd like to do business around here permanently. So they plan to open up a retail center somewhere in northwest Harris County within the next couple of months. This is an incredible event. When we first come down here, we had no idea what this was all about, and it's just been a, a great eye-opener to us. Callahan says he hopes the monument will someday open even more eyes to Reliant Park visitors. This sports facility needs it because each and every year, rodeo takes the time out to pick one day to honor all of our soldiers. By the time Texans descend on next year's rodeo, Callahan hopes the sculpture will be on display as a monument to every American who's ever served in uniform. Ford Atkinson, Fox 26 News.